Now to that shooting in Sterling Heights. Bystanders looked on in shock and fear as a man fired multiple times into an SUV hitting a woman inside. Well, we're told her injuries are not life-threatening, but we first showed you this video last night at 11. It's been getting a lot of views on social media. All of this unfolding at the Park Place condominium complex just off Metro Parkway between Dequender and Ryan. Victor Williams reports it happened with several people watching and children playing nearby. Well, the Sterling Heights neighborhood is the last place you'd expect to find such a violent shooting, but unfortunately, it's the sad reality these residents are dealing with, and here's how it all played out. What you're hearing are the blood curling screams of someone seeing a loved one being shot multiple times at the Park Place condominium complex. We heard the shot, like six shots, and there was a woman yelling. It was kind of scary for us. Police are saying the woman was targeted by a man who, before the shots rang out, was sitting in a pickup truck. As the young woman gets inside of a black Range Rover and backs up, the truck then pulls off, stopping just before a collision, and then in just a split second, nothing but gunfire. A camera in the window captures all of the incident as the woman on the porch watches on in disbelief. Moments later, a car comes back and starts shooting again. The victim makes it away before the shooter speeds off. She was shot multiple times, but is expected to be okay. Right now, there is no clear motive, but police are saying the victim knew the gunman. Neighbors we spoke to are just surprised it happened in their otherwise peaceful neighborhood and that the shooter is still on the loose. We got so scared because this is the first time and it's safe, like kids are playing and the weather was good. Now we did try interviewing the victims to see what exactly they had to say about this horrifying experience and considering the fact that this guy is still out there, they did not talk to us. So if you know anything, Sterling Heights police want to hear from you. Victor Williams, Local 4.